Island Royale National Park is home to an abundance of wildlife, especially moose. As the wolf population declined, moose began to overpopulate the island, impacting the island's vegetation. Yep. Ten bites taken, one available, yeah, ABI 1. three. 9. Across the island, what we're seeing is um, widespread browse of, of certain key species that are vital to the ecosystem of Isle Royale National Park. No browse available. ABI zero. Collecting data on the amount of browse is important to understand how much the moose are taking <laughs> before and after the introduction of the wolves. The goal is that the wolves will mitigate the moose population and stabilize the vegetation that is currently being overeaten by the moose. So the predator is controlling the herbivore, which then controls the vegetation across the island. Park rangers and interns believe the work they are doing is extremely important to the natural habitat of the island, even if conditions aren't always ideal. One day in particular, I was in a cedar swamp. My feet are soaking wet. Uh, I hear mosquitoes buzzing all around me. I look down and my arm is literally coated with mosquitoes to, in some spots I can't even see my skin. But it's like just this weird adrenaline rush and kind of energy you feel just being in the field and knowing you're doing valuable science and um, yeah and, and somewhere like this is just it's it's it really is an incredible experience. Reintroducing wolves to Island Royale National Park will help to balance the moose populations and keep the island's vegetation healthy and beautiful for many years to come.